Good morning! Oh my god, I need to drop my new camera. Good morning, guys. Good morning. How are you doing? It is actually not the morning. It's lunchtime right now, but it's been chucking it down, raining all day so far, and I didn't want to start the vlog until I can officially start it off with a morning. Oh! A morning backflip to get the day started. How are you doing? Hope you're all having a lovely day. Oh, the trampoline's a little bit wet. This is my favourite kind of backflip to do, where you run and you kick round like this. Whoa. Whoa. So it's off of one leg. Today's a blooming good day. Got my PB merch on, repping that, you know. Need to get my butt in the office. I cannot believe that I haven't shown you what I've got done to the office yesterday. I got a little upgrade done. As you come through the door, obviously, like, you guys know the sitch with the office. But anyways, as you go upstairs, check this. So we got pointless book one, pointless book two, pointless book three out now in America and the UK. This is officially out in America too. And of course, the scrapbook of my life. How sick is that? We've got all my book cover, like, oh man. It looks so blooming good. Look, so I'm out of breath from excitement for today. I want to put on some PB merch because it's getting a little bit cold. As you guys know, I've got a ton of PB merch stocked up here. Items that are out, items that aren't out, items that are no longer available because they're sold out. Let me get myself a brand new fresh jumper. Oh, this one was never ever released. When I say to you guys that we properly work on new items all of the time and we're trying to get everything the best it can possibly be, I mean it. Like, let me show you one item. This never ever made it out to you guys. This never got for sale. This is this is a black PB hoodie, but green embroidered. Like that is like stitched in. This is not for sale. Check that. That is pretty sick, isn't it? There is so much cool merch here. If you want one of these, shall I give one of these away now in the video? If you want a grey PB hoodie, I'm gonna send two of you a grey PB hoodie from today's video all you have to do subscribe give the video a thumbs up leave a lovely comment comment down below your Twitter or your Instagram so that I can get in touch with you and then I can DM you via those accounts what was my plan to do today why am I in here I don't feel like I should be in this room I feel like I need to be in this room here I want to finish I want to sort out my gaming setup because as you know I haven't played on my gaming channel I haven't done any gaming in ages My iMac's turning on. I've just realised that even though I've been here like over a month now, I haven't even taken off all of the like cardboard and stuff off of the chairs. <laughs> That's so bad. Should we show everyone your new game? <gasps> What's this? Oh, whoa. she's literally just been going crazy for this ball in my office for the last like half an hour. Do you remember this? From the office? Yeah, there we go. Bring it back. Can I? No? No? Okay. Guess that's that game over. Nala was playing with me properly in the office a minute ago, like bringing it back, dropping it, I was throwing it, she was running along, headbutting it. Give me that ball, give me that ball. Ow, 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 ow. Yes, I got it. I got it. Time to show you what I've been working on. Just switching up my t-shirt first. Putting on a black one, you know? Let me put my sliders on. Head over to the office. Are you coming? Come in then. As you just seen, are you not coming? Nala told me she wants to come to the office. You just told me that you wanted to come to the office. Now you want to go back inside. Okay, go on then. See you later. As you've just seen, I spent this morning working on turning the gaming area in my office into an actual usable gaming area that I can start filming gaming videos in. And that led to getting more and more carried away with upgrading and upgrading the office. So after me and my system worked our butts off all day, 
it is finally time to show you the upgraded. Sorry, my mouth is moving very weirdly at the moment. I've got an ulcer here, an ulcer here, and an ulcer here. So my lips are like crazy right now. It hurts so much. It's time to show you the new office. Office V2. As you come in through the front door, you're greeted with the meeting table, which is where we used to predominantly do all of our work. We would see, we would be sitting at this table. Obviously over here you've got the kitchen, you've got the bathroom, none of that has changed. But over here, instead of being two sofas, we've now got two desks. So this desk here is for the new role, for the new person that I hired. And she officially starts working on Tuesday. So that is her desk. So it's all ready with a little bunch of flowers with some nice candles, dare to begin. Enjoy the little things and dream big. And then over here is my assistant, my PA's desk, which is already getting busy, already getting full. And then this bit is kind of just like gonna gradually, oh, I mean, sorry, that's Nala's, that's Nala's bed there. But this area over here is just gonna gradually get, gonna get used. I've got a big plant that is going here in that corner. However, it's not currently here. I've kind of left it in the bell tent in the garden. And then I would take you upstairs, but I haven't really done much more than what you saw this morning up there, which was just changing the positioning of my computers and putting some microphones there and a camera there, just getting fully ready to start filming points blog game videos again, Sims videos again, just all kinds of gaming videos that I used to film, quizzes and everything again. I feel like this office, is finally turning into like a small little hub, a small company. Not just me and my assistant, we're getting there, we're sl slowly building the team. The way in which I see it going in my head is few people sitting around here, few people at desks and desk areas over there, and having about four, five or six people, hopefully one day, hopefully pretty soon as well, um, working from here. That's, that's what I see. Right, time to head off. Obviously, I do have members of staff working as well. Why has the camera gone like that? There we go. Working for me in an office in London, running the Creator Store, which is the website that does all the merchandise and all the Zoe and Joe's merchandise and Evans and Louis and Tanya's and stuff like that. But they don't work here. They're gonna start working here maybe like one day a week, I think. But that team of people, they work up in London. This is just, this is just like my pointless blog office getting pointless blog stuff done. And it's gradually turning into like a proper little hub, a proper community. And it's especially gonna feel even more like that next week. Bought over a load of PB merch from the office. All brand new, fresh stuff to go put in my wardrobe upstairs so that I can, what are you doing? Are you waiting for mummy? Zoe, are you in the bath? Yeah. Nala's literally just sitting down outside. Go on then, go and say hello. Hello! Hello! Need to pop all these new fresh items into the wardrobe. Get it! Mama! Get it! No, you come and cuddle me. Yesterday, the second, I believe, probably wrong, trailer for the film It uh, came out. And it's number one trending on YouTube. It's got like six million views or something overnight, but I watched it earlier. I watched it earlier. Wait, I want to say... I was say, it was so good. <laughs> I don't mean to be making puns. Oh, well, it was trending, number one. No, it's not. Why is my new video trending? Number one, is that? No, it's that must be due to what we've watched. I, I don't watch Selena Gomez and Charlie XCX. Apparently trending number one, wait, wait, scroll back, is my new video. I do not believe that. But then why has it come up on here? Are you ready? I want to film our reactions to watching this, even though I've already seen it. Turn it up. Because when you're alone as a kid... Oh no. The monster see you as weaker. Have you seen who that kid is? Have you seen? You don't even know if they're dead. No. I'm so excited. Is it someone from Stranger Things? Mm-hmm. He follows me on Twitter. Until it's too late. This is terrifying. Oh. He's not from Stranger Things. No, not him. Oh. I'm gonna leave a link down below to the trailer. You need to check it out if you like horror movies. Where's this the is the one. Things, boy? You'll see in a second. <laughs> oh! Look, see? Oh, yeah! He's got Bob's, he's got Bob's glasses on. 
You're floating. Look, look, you missed them floating. Oh my god. This looks terrifying. Oh god, one of them's real. Which one's real? That one. Oh it looks so, so good. Great. September the 8th, Joe's birthday. Is it? Chucky 7. I've never seen any Chucky films. Let's have a look at this one. Ever. We're currently watching a program called Posh Pets. And this guy here runs a cookery school in a five star hotel right near where Zoe used to live. And he's currently teaching the guests in the cookery school how to cook dog biscuits for your dog. Like proper five star posh hotel teaching you how to cook dog biscuits. And one of the guys on here, as Nala's going crazy because of all the dogs on the TV. One of the guys on here has just said he's never ever given his dog any treats or food without him trying it first to make sure it tastes good. That is crazy. That's literally ludicrous. Look at all the dogs sitting down for lunch. That's so fun. Oh my gosh, Nala. She thinks the dogs are behind the TV. All I'm saying is that I've got a very... <laughs> Why are you pulling that face? Look at yours. I am yours looks delicious you. compared to mine <laughs> looks like baby food. <laughs> I skinned my potato and just meshed it all up. We've got jagged potato, beans and cheese for dinner. For me, that's not a very big portion. So I feel like there may be a late night McDonald's run tonight to get some chicken nuggets to fill me up because I kind of didn't put anything else with it. Guys, what the hell is happening to me? It's Friday night. It's 10.35 and I've just woken up on the sofa. Why am I asleep at 10.35 on a Friday? I never thought this was going to happen to me. I thought I was forever going to be incredibly young and going to pubs with friends and stuff like that and instead me and my girlfriend and my dog are asleep on the sofa on a Friday at 10.35. I can't explain it. Like legit can't explain it. The only thing to make me feel better is to get a Magnum and a dime bar for Zoe. She's fast asleep on the sofa. I have no idea how I forgot to end this vlog. Like, I have become so bad at ending my videos recently. I apologize. I'm gonna get better at it. But as you saw, I was like, <laughs> I was knackered last night. I didn't even think I was tired. I was joking about how like crazy Friday night. And then the next thing I knew, I woke up on the sofa. And you know when you have a nap, and you either wake up, there's like a 10% chance that you're gonna wake up feeling good, and then there's like a 90% chance that you're gonna wake up and you literally feel like you've just woken up after a night out, you're just like, oh, like hungover kind of feeling. That's exactly how I felt when I woke up on the sofa. I think it was because it was so hot in there, because with the, anyways, with the fire on and stuff, I forgot to end the vlog. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe down below, link to my merch down below, as usual, and um, it's currently the next day for me. Just planning a super fun day. Got some fun stuff happening. Some cool things. So I'll catch you in the morning. Catch you tomorrow. Goodbye, guys. Good night. Goodbye. I never, I never, I never, I never, I, I know the book.